Um, so the next analysis that we're gonna use is the Fast Fourier Transforms. Um, freshmen will be using this in BioE 100 in the next coming weeks. Um, and it's a um, filter of an image and uh, it can uh, find areas of pattern and subtract them, add them, compose them together. Um, so that's what we're gonna do right now. A little walkthrough. Um, all right, file open again. And this, it just takes in this folder every time because that's where I have been frequently going. But I take this picture. Um, and first we're gonna use a bandpass filter to make the picture a little bit more even. Um, so you go to FFT, process FFT bandpass filter. Um, and so the one to 30, you just include in these, this, these two um, lines, um, hit OK. And so then it, we can see our picture has been updated. Um, and now we're gonna do the actual Fourier transform. So just as easy as process, FFT, FFT. Um, so this is what it'll look like. And to, um, Galecki will go into more depth about really what um, Fourier transform is, um, but so use your rectangular selector, I forgot to do my rectangular. You choose the horizontal portion, and then I'm just gonna do edit, um, clear outside, and then we're gonna actually do an inverse FFT to just subtract all the horizontal pattern. So as you can see here, this image only has the vertical patterns here of these two lines. So let me get rid of this picture and then I'm gonna have to do it again to do the same thing, but to extract only the horizontal pattern. So um, FFT, FFT, and then we're gonna do a rectangle selector of just the vertical line, edit, clear outside, and then we're gonna do process, FFT, and inverse again. So here, as you can see, this has only the horizontal um, patterns. It has subtracted these two vertical lines and they have been separated in both of these two pictures. Um, another important thing um, that you guys will be doing is merging the channels of these pictures. So um, that is something that Bavika already talked about, or actually Iksha already talked about. Um, and so you just, the same thing, merge channels, choose your files, maybe name them a little bit better um, so that you know which one's which. And um, then you'll get a picture like this. It's kind of hard to see, but it's purple and green. Um, or no, that's not it. This is it, yeah, here we go. So we took our vertical and our horizontal and made it so that all of the horizontal components were purple and all the vertical were green. Um, so 